Hi guys, Mick Price here. Lot 545 from Melbourne Premier is a super Vobus filly, plus Vobus size filly, real racehorse. It's a filly with a page, and I reckon for what we paid, um, I think it's fantastic value. I would have paid a lot more for this filly. I've been after a nice Toronado. I mean, he gets horses that can, well, they're sort of flying machines. Greg Urell's horses really fast. Sassy Salatage, Prince of Sussex, if you remember it, before it went to Hong Kong of Matty Laurie's, um, it was a flying machine. Uh, I reckon this horse with its pedigree, it's out of a tough flying spur mare. Uh, she's a good brood mare. Uh, we had a horse down the bottom of the page called Heart of Dreams, who was a sprinter miler and one of the Australian guineas in the underwood. So I think it's a really good page. So there's residual value when we finish with it. And it's a really nice flying spur type of filly. Uh, it's medium sized. It's elegant filly. Uh, she's not big, strong, heavy type of filly. I reckon she's a real runner, uh, which is what I want. Um, you know, when I'm looking at the Toronados and looking at the fast horses, this filly looks like she's gonna be a flying machine. Uh, she's immature at the moment. She is a 7th of October foal, so if you picture her this time next year, I think you're going to have a really nice filly. Uh, she still seems knitted up in the knees. Uh, very happy with that part of it, so she may make a two-year-old. Uh, but yeah, look, we'll do our normal um, in and out preparations with her and have a look at her to see if she will be a two-year-old. But, um, gee, she's a flying spur filly. I mean, many moons ago I had a flying spur, spur filly called Rodine who won a Blue Diamond, although I had to give it back. Uh, but she reminds me a bit of her, athletic, clean walking, lovely filly, and not expensive. Jump on the website, give Shona a call or myself a call, and uh, send us an email because uh, I think she's a really nice opportunity with a great page also.